Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Ramble SMP. Guys, it is a fantastic day. We are going to be doing a lot of stuff. I just did a trade with our buddy Hoax Pocus. He just hopped off Hoax Poke. Um, yeah, so we traded. I traded two stacks of bone blocks, and he gave me an IOU. I also got one from... Amradon and Amradorn, sorry, and uh, we'll be using those later on. But yes, we got to go to the Nether because we got to go kill a few blazes so we can get some blaze rods and craft some potions. Because today, guys, we are gonna be taking on several guardian temples, so we need all of the help and invisibility and stuff like that we can get. Um, now I'm not too sure where the closest one is. Probably should have done some research before I got here. Let's make a little hidey hole real quick. Alright, so the one we're going to be going to is at negative 153,244. Um, yes, so it's this way. Okay, so we're going to make our, make our way downtown. And I don't have any feather falling. Do we have any fire protection? Uh, we've got protection on everything, at least protection three. So we should be okay, even if I were to fall into some lava, though I don't really want to do that. Um, but yeah, uh, let's go ahead and make our way over there. All right, we're kind of at the end of the open space here. It doesn't mean we get to get a little bit of... Um, this is basalt. I was going to say basalt, but I didn't want to say the wrong thing. Okay, so 244. Uh, so it's that way. Uh, did I bring enough cobble? I might not have. Interesting. Oh, well. Looks like we're going to have to just build straight with the cobble and make ladders in the, the nether. Not ladders, stairs. All right, this is what I mean. So we go in by one. And we do get some of the blackstone. Very cool. Oh, yep. That's what we got to be careful of. It's funny. I was about to say. I'm like, we got to be really careful of, you know, these lava pockets that show up. And look what happened right after that. Most of uh, the other people I've talked to about the uh, this biome. I don't know exactly what this biome is called. But they are not fans of it. And I'm like, why not? I think it's because of those lava pockets. Yeah, look at that. Here's our fortress. Okay. So we are going to curve 90 degrees here and go this way. And I already got a blaze. What I want to do is put this here so I know... Because this is the way we're going to get back. And how... All right, he's already got eyes on us, but he's gone. <laughs> he's just going to keep getting aggroed. And then he's going to fall back down. Oh, one shot. Let's go. Uh, we're going to do this the easy way. Look at that. Oh, we're getting shot at. All right, we can get this crappy thing off. Ooh, we got a blaze spawner and an open one, which is a little terrifying, but okay. Um, yeah. Well, I wonder if that trick still is in effect. Actually, we need to reverse these. Yeah, so you can still shoot like that, but I don't know if it gives the looting effect when you shoot things. Ah, frick. That wasn't very successful. How much of that we got left? Ah, we're good. Okay. Yes, we got our first blaze rod. All right. I've got infinity on this bow. I think it's a infinity power, all the goods. Uh, I'm breaking punch infinity power. Yes, yeah, so this thing's pretty pretty nice. Where the heck did that magma cube come from? He's got such a reach. We got blaze behind. Okay. All right. So I want at least three blaze raw. Oh wow, we have eight. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're going to kill a few more of these guys. Yeah, we're getting lots of blaze rods. So we're going to need even more. I don't know the exact amount we're going to need, but it's going to be a few. Wow, what a shot. 
All right, so we're back at the base here. Super duper excited because now we get to go raid some of the Guardian Temples. Uh, now we have one that is really close to us that we're going to be raiding right away. Um, and this will actually become our eventual base. Now, I did mark out over here a spot saying this would be my starter base, but this is actually going to be where I put my shop, where I sell all my sea lanterns. So, yeah, it says turtles base. That's a lie. This is going to be our base. We're going to build a giant underwater dome with a built-in guardian farm. It's going to be fantastic. So, the goal of the rest of the episode is to raid four of these. So I want to raid this one and three others. We have four TNT, so we can raid four of these. Um, yeah, so let's get started. All right, now I assume this is going to be hot going in. Um, we're dropping in hot boys on the Guardian Temple. Here we go. We already got that. That is exactly why we have the TNT. We can take it. Oh, well, that, that, that worked. All right, we light it, and then we do that. There we go. We can go in. Come here, you stupid big guy. What the frick? Don't blast me. All right, this is why we brought these things. Let's see. We got to be quick about it. There we go. Okay, so we have our little air pocket here. Even though I do have a lot of air, um, we do need this. Oh. Well, let's just light it on fire. There we go. All right. Okay, let's swim on over. Back here, we're going to heal up, eat. Perfect. Yep, this is going super duper smooth. Now we have a total of three of these guys, but we're really here for the sponges. There we go. We got our first dude. We got a head. We got an elder guardian head. Get out of here, stupid idiot. Okay, we need to we need to find the other dudes. Okie dokie. Sleeping through the night. Great. Mob cap isn't going to be taken up by normal mobs. If we keep swimming like this, cutting off line of sight will be okay. Uh, we're about halfway done with our, our high quality air. Air 2O. So what we're going to do is we come here to this corner and we just spam torches. So then we come up here, collect all of our dudes. Perfect. Look at that. Whoa, that was weird. We don't need water breathing yet because that would require us to go fishing for a while, and I don't want to do that. Is this the front door? Yes, the front door. Oh gosh, we're gonna get hit. Just kidding. It'd be great if we had like a dolphin outside, you know. Okay, I think we might be on to something. Nope, not on to something. All right, torch trick. We gotta hurry. Got three bubbles left. Perfect. All right. See, with that, we have no need for a water po a water breathing potion, and we found out where the other guy's at. He should be in here somewhere. Oh my! This might be bad. Okay, we're gonna need to make a little hidey hole. Uh, break line of sight. Okay. There we go. Okay. Whew. Let's heal up for a second. All 
All right, let the battle commence. Still got mining fatigue, so we got to set this one on fire. Armor's looking pretty good. Ah! Okay. Should be fine. Come here! Around the pole. Oh, don't lag. Don't lag, game! Game, don't lag! Oh, no! Bad. Bad times. Bad times. We're good. We're good. Oh, one heart. Oh, my gosh. So intense. If you didn't have all of these little ads around, we'd be fine. The Guardians, ugh. That's what's keeping them all safe. Hurting us. Should have brought, like, a, a golden apple or something. Feel kind of dumb. Okay. Here we go. Juke him out, juke him out, juke him out, juke him out. Come here. There we go. Second sponge, second Elder Guardian. Ouch time. Okay. Yeah, we got it. Okay. I wanted to make sure. Gonna get booped in the butt. It's okay. Or not. All right, how are we looking? Need some air. Oh, good. Good. Have a nice night. Hey! We got out. We got ouch time. We're gonna get blasted here pretty good. That's fine. Okay. Got a heal. Around the corner. He's chasing. He's pursuing. He wants to die. I'm gonna die. Don't glitch. I did not think this through. I made it too, too compact. Oh my word, that took forever. All right, let's go kill this Elder Guardian. We'll get out of here. It's going the wrong way. <laughs> this will be our future base area. I'm super excited. We're also going to get a bunch of the Prismarines so that we can go ahead... And build some of the the heart of the sea things. And that is the last one, dudes. We have successfully raided this guy. Now, the guardians are still going to spawn, obviously. Holy crap, there's a dolphin. See, that's what I could have need. That's what I could have used before. We are lightning freaking McQueen, my guys. Okay. So now we got to work on getting out of here. Uh... Mining fatigue's about to wear off, too. It's gone. So let's do this. Perfect. All right, so we can get our health back. Let's eat real quick. And let's get the frick out of here. Actually, we need to find the sponge room. Um, I believe that's somewhere in the center. There's a bunch of gold here. But the sponge room's normally up high. Where did you go, sponge room? I don't know what I'm saying. That was a scary noise. We're back. We've gone in a circle. Okay, not this way. Definitely not that way either. I think it'll be somewhere by... Actually, this is a good room to air up in.
premium way of getting your oxygen back. You just create a little air hole, you know, because that's how that works. You just breathe. This is weird. Do guardians not have a melee attack? It's kind of weird if they don't. See, I don't think someone's already been here because the guardians were still here. And trying to f mine the sponges without killing a guardian would be extremely, like, time-consuming. I hope no one's done it. That would kind of suck. Hmm. Can't seem to find the sponge room on this one. Oh, well. Well, get out of me boat. All right, so let's sleep real, real, real quick, and then we will go find the next one. All right, so the next one's about 500 blocks this way, uh, so I'm going to go ahead and travel there, uh, and then we'll take on those guardian, or the, the elder guardians. I, I have brought along one golden apple. I don't have any more apples, so that's something we need to look into, but uh, yeah, I'll see you when I'm there. All right, check it out. We've got one right here already. I don't think anyone's been into this one yet. I hope so anyway, uh, so we're going to see what we can do. Uh, hopefully this one's the sponge room is still intact. Let's get rid of the F3 screen. Okay. Uh, I think we're just going to go through the front door this time. Uh, don't glitch. Stu oh, thank you, Guardian. <laughs> okay. Immediately right up. Kind of crazy. Let's see what we got. Okay, so this room's in a weird spot. There should be a guardian over here. Yes, sir, there he is. Okay, we're gonna get wrecked if we don't be careful in this room. Ooh, yeah, we're hurting. All right. There we go. Look at that. Already working. Sweet. Okay, let's go kill this guy. Where'd he go? Cotton Eye Joe, there you are. Run back to the fort. Okay. We really do kind of have a little fort going. Let's eat. All right, back to the fight. There he goes. Okay, so one down. Make sure we grab everything. Yippers. Go ahead and heal up real quick. We'll wait, stand up. We'll just eat one. Okay, yep, so we got the Elder Guardian's head. Very cool. This is a weird Guardian Temple. Oh gosh, we got a lot of dudes. Unfortunately, we're the only people on. Well, Got a camera count on.
Okay. So we're good in here. We can set fire to the rain over there. There we go. Perfect. Let us go kill this one. There it was. Wow, that was easy. So I guess I'm swinging my sword a little bit too fast, so I need to ease off on that one. But all right. So let's find... We got to go up. This is down. Maybe you go down to go up. No, you don't. Yeah, that's where we came from. Okay, so we gotta get out of this little area somehow. We go up here? We can. Okay. How are we doing on air? We're doing good on air. Okay. And this goes nowhere. Might not be a bad time to here up a little bit um got an idea okay well maybe not the best idea still got my buckets on me Okay, so now we're over here. Okay, we're going the wrong way. Yep, we still got a Elder Guardian here, but how do we get to him? Okay, so... The center is a little bit off in this place, so maybe we go here. Not getting anywhere good. I'm running low on ox wide gen. Oop, didn't think this through. Sponge room. Okay, so we have a sponge room here. Fantastic. Need to find this other guy, though. Oh, we were just here. Okay. Unfortunately, we can't really stop in one spot. Um, this is not good. Okay. Ah. Perfect. Okay. So let's go where to? I think we just have to find our way back out and then just blow up the top like we were originally going to do. Okay. That's the plan. Oh, don't lag, game. Come on. Bro. I 
干的点That somehow freaking worked. Okay, so we blew, blew that up. Did we get any sponges out of that? Yeah, we got, nope, we didn't get any. Oh, freaking ain't gonna work. Well, yep, that worked. Cool. All right, well, we're out of TNT, unfortunately. We gotta use it for here. Get out of the way. Good. Whoa, boy. <laughs> Holy crap, that was close. Okay, I'll get some. Need to heal. Oh man. And then we're gonna look for the original room in the in the first guardian temple after this. Let's go kill this sucker. There we go. All right, that was the final one. Let's get over to the sponge room. And we'll kind of hunker down over here until, until we uh, need to, like until the binding fatigue goes away. All right, so the mining fatigue is gone. Let's go ahead and do some collecting. Now, we are going to block this off from letting the guardians get in. Because I don't really want any friends right now. I'm going solo, if you know what I mean. All right, perfect. So, we do have... Yep, cool. Going to mine it pretty quick. I will leave this one here because this will give us our little air pocket. If I mine that one, our air pocket will probably disappear. I don't want, I don't want that. Our air pocket's gone anyway. Oh, well. Okay, so that is all of the sponges. We have 35 now. Very cool. And we're going to mine this here. And boom, let's hop back on our... Again, get out of my boat! Where's my boat? Where my boat? Where my boat? Where my boat? Boat, boat, go! There's my boat! Make like the wind and get the heck out of here. Aight, let's go! Okay, dude, so it's actually been a little bit of time. I did figure out that that, uh, where to go? The, the sea temple over here, this one actually didn't spawn with a sponge room. I loaded up the world seed that we had here, 
and then uh, like was flying around it and uh, didn't find a single one. I flew around it for probably 20 minutes trying to find it because I thought it was just being blind. But uh, yeah, doesn't doesn't have one, so we're good to go there. A uh, little bit of time has passed. I did go ahead and make an entrance to the skeleton farm. I made my first YouTube short on that. A uh, little card will be up in the top right if you guys want to check that out. Pretty cool. Uh, that was a lot of fun to make. It only took me about uh, 40 minutes to make, but that was a blast. And then we've also got some pumpkins over here because it is spooky season this time. Um, so I'm probably going to do a project with a member of the server, uh, kind of foreshadowing for the future. Uh, but we'll need a lot of pumpkins, obviously. Uh, so yeah, be on the lookout for that. And then I also have been growing a moss cave over here. I've just been playing around with the moss. It's, it's a lot cooler than I originally thought. And I haven't even done anything with this stuff yet. Uh, but yeah, we got one of the, the flowering azaleas. I've already got another one over here that I grew. And man, these are cool. But uh, we need to go ahead and take a trip to spawn right now. Uh, but I need to sleep first. All right, sleepy time done, and my boat's not here. Where did you go? Cotton Eye. Oh, there you go. So, we're going to go ahead and take a trip over to spawn. It's pretty neat. We're going to go way over here. All right, so we're going to go ahead and park our boat here. It's pretty close to Emmerdarn's base. Um, he is full steam ahead. It's fantastic. You guys got to check out the videos they're putting out. Uh, link is down in the description, but yeah, he's got a lot going on. I don't want to spoil too much. I don't know what he's what he's uh, done, and I we have no idea whose base that is. But that is filling up rather quickly. So uh, yeah, just going to be going through the terrain here. I don't even know whose base that is. I might have to go check that out. Okay, so it looks like they're going for a mountain kind of base. Who is this? Kit's house. Oh, okay. Well, very cool. I don't want to spoil it, obviously. Um, but very, very cool. I like that. That's a cool feature. There's a bunch of chests up there, too. And access. Oh. Oh, okay. That makes sense. We've stumbled onto someone else's base here. Okay, let's go ahead and see whose it is. I like, I love the roof. Man, that's a, I didn't even think about doing that before. The wall and then the fence on top of that. Mm-mm-mm. It looks great. This is the back, I think, because there's no door. Oh, this, that's the side. Whose base is the, these? Uh, whoa. Whoa. When you're zoomed in like that and you jump, it kind of freaks you out a little bit. Okay, so I don't know who that is. Uh, someone's up over there as well. There's so much going on. I don't know whose base is whose. Oh, no, I need to eat my golden carrots. Oh, yes. That is fantastic. That's E's base. I'm going to call me because I can't pronounce his name. And Davar, I don't want to say it wrong. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Jeez Louise, that's fantastic. Where is this giant egg? Where? I need egg. Please. I don't even remember where Spawn is at this point. Wait a second. I recognize this spot. Bell Hunt. I thought this was Egg. Bell hunt. Uh, diamond blocks go here. Uh, what? Oh, it's so hard to read. One diamond block to enter. Bell hunt rules. Okay. 
First to a thousand bells will win the prize. You can find random bells scattered across the land. There will be challenges, bounties, and tasks in order. To obtain more bells, the bells will be renamed Bell Hunt, so no cheating. Uh, most of most of all, have fun and good luck hunting bells. Ah, very cool. Sweet. I don't know if I'm spoiling. I'm probably spoiling. I'm just looking for egg. Aha! This is egg! Okay. <laughs> Please grab your book. Um. Yes! Super Turtles consents. Okay. Grab my book. Turtle's egg. Okay. Your egg is your conscience. Lose your egg or break it. Your science now broken. Time to do. Time to go a little insane for a while. Better not break that egg. Rules. You can hide your egg anywhere in your base. It has to be in an item frame. It must be visible and accessible. So no hiding it in an underground one by one area. So hide it well or even create a puzzle or challenge to find your egg. If you are to capture somebody else's egg, you must destroy it in front of that player. If you do not, you will suffer the consequences as well as your own. So choose your moment carefully. <laughs> Once you have your egg, you will have up to one week to hide it. Best of all, have fun and be creative. I suggest not recording where you hide your egg because we don't want spoilers unless you're creating a puzzle, of course. Just don't reveal how to do it. Good luck. Uh, if your egg is too break, you must sacrifice a turtle to the Minecraft gods. Failure to do so. <laughs> Change your Minecraft skin to the body of a fish and the head of a lion for one week. <laughs> Frick yeah, dude. Let's do this. Okay, so it's very important that we keep that egg very, very well hidden. Um, I don't even have a few ideas of where to hide it. Uh, shoot. Let's see. Well, I can't tell you, because you guys might spoil it, even though you guys are amazing. You probably wouldn't. I'm the only one on. All right. So let's hatch this diabolical plan. Okay, so it says you can hide your egg anywhere in your base. So we can't do something silly and then go hide it on, like, some random tree or something like that. Uh, so that's out of the picture. So it's got to be in our little base. Um, it must be visible. and We can't hide it. So we can't put it really in the skeleton farm because everyone knows where that is. I put the coordinates in, in our Discord so, no one, so like everyone will be able to find it. Uh, I need to go this way, actually. So we've got one week to hide it. It is very important that I drain that sea monument very quickly and move in. If I'm able to do that, I can it's going to be very difficult for someone to find the egg. Though, that that being that it's a challenge will probably encourage people to find it or to go looking for it. Ugh, man, they're so... Man, I, I had the first death of the server. I'm probably going to be the first egg to be found, so I'm kind of worried about that. Or we can just go full out. What if we make a special base? Sorry, this is my boat now. What if we make a special base, like a temporary base that no one knows the location of? I left my boat. It's right, it's literally right over there. Ha, you threw that potion bad. Stop throwing potions, witch. <laughs> you will not be sacrificed, my friend. I will save you. By hiding my egg. Mm. Was that a trident? Okay, let's see if I can get this on camera. I've fought so many of these dudes. Where's he at? Okay, so those are coming from this way. All right, dude. You're about to give me that trident. Did he give it? Sad. 
Is it floating? No. It's like the sixth or seventh dude I've killed with a that had a tried to nothing. I remember sometimes I'd start a new world and he doesn't have an Akko shell, he survives. Start a new world and you know, I'd get a trident on the first one and people are like, I can't get a trident. And I'm like, I don't know what you're talking about. Now I'm in the, the opposite role. Uh okay. So we need an item frame. Hmm. I've got a diabolical idea. <laughs> I've got a diabolical idea. <laughs> okay, we we won't rename this or anything like that, I promise. But it is going to be so difficult for anyone to find it. I have the perfect idea. I will get into that next episode. But ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching. Uh, we're going to be playing this a lot more, so I hope to see you all then. But anyways, guys, take care. Peace out. Bye-bye.